All right, today we're coming for Ariel to sign a letter of intent for college. We're very proud of Ariel. Ariel sought and worked hard. She worked hard in the classroom. She's got the grades. So then she worked hard on the field because she had a dream of playing college softball. And she worked very hard for this opportunity. And we're very proud of Ariel for being able to go really up near Chicago. She's going to be a long ways away from us but we know that she will succeed due to the background that she's shown here. So thank you, Ariel. Okay, we're here today with Millington's Ariel, and um, today's your signing day. I know you worked hard to get to this point. You even had to work hard during the summer to get to this point. What does this day mean to you? It means a lot. It just shows that I worked really hard, and I deserve this. Yes, ma'am, we definitely do. And uh, where are we heading off to? Ancilla College. It's in Indiana. Okay, and we're in Indiana. Donaldson, Indiana. Okay, so that's just outside of South Bend, uh, Notre Dame territory. Yeah. They play some good softball up there. Are you ready for the challenge? I am. So what do you hope to get out of your experience there? Um, it's going to be a good grade of competition, so I guess you want to, do you want to end up going to a four-year college? I do want to end up going to a four-year college. So what are you going to do once you, what are you hoping to take advantage of just what Ariel say these next two years? How do you want to improve as a player? Um, I mean, I want to get better than I already am, improve in certain areas. Now, the last couple of years for the Milton Lady Trojan, you had to be a leader. Kind of reflect on, you know, just, I guess, stepping up with a lot of young players the last couple of years and trying to be a leader for them. Yes. So talk about it, just um, being a leader. Yeah, I had to be a leader because, you know, I was a senior and had to show the younger players what to do and what to expect when they get up there in their senior years and just be a leader for them. So what do you think you gained from that experience the last couple of years? Um, I think I gained a lot of respect for some of the players. Now you definitely get respect from the program because you continue the tradition of Lady Trojan signing. What does that mean for you to represent Millington way up there in Indiana? It means a lot to me because um, <laughs> Take your time. I know you moved, you moved around as a youth, you know, military bred as yes. a term, Hawaii, California, Virginia, mm -hmm. but y'all made it home here the last 10 years, 11 years. Mm -hmm. So I know it must mean a lot to you to you know, represent that black and gold, yes. Lady Trojan Nights. So can I just t take a moment to talk about that? Um, my last four years here at Millington were really good. Softball team was decent. Wish we could have been better. Well, you were one of the bright spots of the team the last couple of years, and you get to carry on that name up to the next level. So we're proud of you here in Millington, and we want to congratulate you on Thank your big you. day. Thank you. Appreciate your time. Thank you.